you know, you mentioned, um, you alluded to a little bit just with transition game. You know, you mentioned leading up to the postseason, that was something you guys, you know, really wanted to be able to show. Just what are your thoughts on, on how you guys were able to, you know, play in transition and score points off turnovers today? I said, everything starts. If you want to have a transition game, it has to start on the defensive end. You can't keep taking the ball out of the net and have as good a transition game as if you're forcing turnovers or you're getting out uh, off on defensive rebound. So, uh, you know, our team plays really well in transition. It's it's a big part of our offense. It's a big part of our game. And um, having 10 players back and having access to all of them and being able to, you know, have a rotation, I think, plays into all that because now they can keep up with Nika as she's pushing the ball. So the defense was great, and that led to everything else. You talked earlier in the year about being able to extend the pressure because you had the team that could at least run a little bit more. Um, what Was there a play that stuck out for you where you finally said, okay, this is the team that I was expecting to see? Yeah, there were, there were a couple. There were a couple, um, there were a couple traps that we had that uh, were really, really good, and um, we had two of them in particular that – uh, Dorka got in front of one and um, uh, had a great steal. AZ had a great one. Um, so we're in a position where we can do that now, and they enjoy it. So that's not something that you can do all game, every game, but I think it's something that certainly, um, you know, that we want to do. Seems like throughout her career, Aaliyah's played her best basketball in the NCAA tournament. What is it about this time of year that helps her um, get to another level? I mean, she would be the best to answer that. I think the <clears throat> the um, <clears throat> the object of every kid is growing up. You know, in any sport. You know, I want to hit a three-run homer in the World Series. You know. I, uh, I want to score the winning touchdown. Whatever the case may be, I want to play in the NCAA tournament. You're a kid playing basketball. I want to play in the NCAA tournament. You know, I want to, <clears throat> you know, I, I want to be that person that everybody talks about. You know, that plays great in March. That's just something you have to want to have and want to do. And um, you know, there's a level that Aaliyah hasn't gotten to yet, even. And if she can get there, um, I think there's probably even more in her than, than what we saw today. We asked the players this, but what was your reaction to Inesh's block? I wasn't watching. <laughs> <laughs> I just assumed it was going to be a foul. So I turned the other way. So I'll probably I'll watch it some other, some other time when I'm retired. <laughs> this is 26, 30 winning seasons in 30 seasons in the last 30 seasons. I, I thought, told that to Beth Mullins. Absurd. How would you describe it? Absurd. Uh, I would describe it as um, I would describe it as hard to describe because I, I I don't have the words for it. Even though I did it, I was here. I saw all of it, and I still don't know how how I would describe it. You know. Um, Obviously, the consistency is what's amazing for me. The how the players change every four years, and they, you know, our leagues changed. You know, um, I just think it's a testament to the people that we bring in here, from a coaching staff, support staff, and the players. And if not for COVID, it'd probably be 18 in a row. <laughs> yeah, yeah. COVID threw a little bit of a wrench into things, but. Um, um, some people have worse things than not winning 30 games, you know. So we just we just feel like this is what this is what our program is supposed to do. Now you say, well, you're supposed to win 30 games, 26 years in a row, or 27 years in a row, or whatever the number is, 26 out of 30. No, I don't think you're supposed to, but that's kind of what you're supposed to do. <laughs> What do you say all the time? If it was easy, everyone would do it. Yeah, I say it all the time. If it was easy, everybody else would do it. And they would tell you, well, it's because you get the best players in the country. Oh? Okay.
then I'm really impressed with all those coaches who coach bad players and win 27 or win 30 games every year. I'm really impressed by that.